So hey guys, how's it going? I'm just gonna give you an update on Australia today. I'm gonna name this one Halloween, because it's kind of like a Halloween-y time for me. Uh, last time you saw me, I was just about to move into my apartment. I moved in a day. Today, uh, we've currently been in there three weeks. So it's been quite a while, a lot, quite a lot of stuff happened. It's been pretty good. Um, so in my apartment, we've got me and Mel, Lauren and Caitlin. In the other rooms, we've got three Spanish guys called um, Juan Adolfo, which, you know, borderline, uh, borderline, <laughs> this borderline name, Adolfo. Anyway, uh, Adolfo, Ruben. Uh, in the other room, we've got two Germans, Kevin and. I don't know if you have a guy's name, to be honest with you. He's a great guy. I've talked to him a lot, I just don't know his name. It, just because it's really hard to pronounce. Uh, and then there's also Marius. So, apartment's going great. Um, other side to things, the job. <laughs> Not going so great, I've lost that already. Basically, so the job was fundraising. It wasn't as... It was... I don't know, I was expecting it to be hard. But also, I was expecting to be like, okay, well, if you actually, like, power through and just be really chill, it'd be easy, right? Because I, I, I get on easy talking to people. But the one thing I didn't really consider, and the one thing that, like, affected me most, is I hate asking for money. It's just so awkward, and obviously people react differently when you're asking for money. Not even that, they ask differently, they act differently when you have a shirt on and a badge and all that. Because I was going to people, hey guys, can I ask a quick question? And they would just ignore me. If, it, if I just want to on them, hey, can I ask a quick question? They'd be like, yeah, what's wrong, buddy? You know, they'd actually be concerned, they want to ask, hear the question. But they just said, like, everyone has a pre, pre-judgment of when they see you. Anyway, so first day went okay, I didn't get anyone to sign up. I got very close, I did get very close. Um, next day, we go in at 9am. I was already considering not even going in on that day, because it was crap. But we go in, Caitlin goes in even. And then, uh, D is like... Hey, uh, I'm really sorry, you know, it's not my decision, the managers called it, called me this morning. Uh, I tried to say no, but, I think, you know, I tried to convince them out of it, but you guys have to lose your job. And we were like, yay. And, you know what I mean? Because, like, we didn't want to be there anyway. So, that job's gone. Uh, I'm looking for another job, but realistically, like, why is there a giant bird walking towards me? <laughs> He's going to tell me. Um, realistically, I'm looking for another job. I'm not in an urgent state right now. Uh, hopefully, I'll get one within two weeks. I've applied for loads of places, just waiting for a reply. Yeah, we'll just see what happens. I'll, I'll keep you updated on that. I'm going to get that by bird. I'm actually going to die. Uh, we, I also went to a silent disco, which was the best thing I've ever done. It, it's kind of... It's in... This bird's actually going to kill me. He's eyeing me out so much. Ah. Um, I'm actually scared right now. <laughs> um, yeah, I went to the Sky Silent Disco. Basically, it's like this, where you just put headphones on. There's no music playing out loud. You only hear head music here. So if you take your headphones off, everyone's dancing to no music, basically. Uh, and it was cool because you had colours on each channel. So you could see which channel everyone was on and then like turn it to their channel. Oh no, there's crap moves, like, turn it to a different channel. Um, it was also in an aquarium, so that made it ten times better. It was so cool. Um, we'll go in again on Friday because there's a, it's like, it's not every two weeks, but it, it just happened that it was every two weeks this week. So, yeah, we're going again. Uh, there was a dog thing the next day, so it was pretty spicy. Went to this dog thing. Basically, it was just a dog fest. Loads of dogs there. And it was actually incredible. Like, it was insane how many puppies there were. I held a puppy, you know, Dalmatians, Spaniels, and me and Lauren. Oh, my God. Um, I did actually go there again later that day with Phoebe, who was someone I met at work, actually. Phoebe's really chill. She's really funny. Uh, yeah. Actually, Phoebe is a good reason why... Uh, <coughs> sorry. <coughs> Let me reword that. Phoebe is one of the positives I got from my work. Cause she just it's refreshing having someone different to talk to that no one else is friends with or that you hardly ever see you know what I mean because I love LT I love MAO I love Caitlin but at the same time spending every day with them it's probably gonna get boring eventually 
So the fact that if someone to talk to that isn't one of them is pretty chill. Um, dog was great. The dentist, I had to go to the dentist because before I came out, I was meant to have an operation on one of my teeth and I couldn't fit it in because I only had a week to, like, they only told me a week before, they were like, yeah, you need this. We had a week of appointments, so they were like, oh, we're all booked in, we can fit you in for November. Yeah, fuck you guys. Uh, <laughs> so I had to come out here, I was hoping not to do anything, but the teeth started appearing, not a lot, but in a way that it was kind of ruining the holiday a little bit. I love how I called it a holiday. Um, it was kind of ruining Australia a little bit, so I was like, you know what, I have to get this sorted out. I've got it sorted out now. It's actually so nice having no pain. But, that being said, it costs a lot of money. <laughs> um, final thing, the other day, because it's close to Halloween, we did car uh, pumpkin carvings. It was so much fun. It was unbelievable how much fun it was. Uh, Emil had never done it before. Me and Lauren did it. We were going to watch Nightmare Before Christmas at the same time, but we didn't. Uh, but yeah, it was just a lot of fun. Me, me and Lauren did different pumpkins. Emil did kind of did a pumpkin. <laughs> but it, it's just kind of cool that we have this kind of family vibe. I know that's stupid, but like, because Lauren's really old, um, she's kind of like a mum figure. Uh, and then we just like do what she says. <laughs> but no, it is cool. We've got so much stuff planned. We're doing Thanksgiving, Hanukkah. Christmas, um, we've got so many holidays planned, that's another one as well, I can't remember what it was, but we've got so much stuff planned, we're doing a run, we're doing Sonic Disco again, uh, that probably, the run a bit definitely be in the next video, hopefully I'll also have a job in my next video that I'm learning, but yeah, until then guys, thank you for watching, everyone at home, how's it going, you know, Elliot, you're probably watching this, or Jason, or someone, I don't know, hey mum, how you like, say Lily, I don't know if anyone's watching this, uh, anyway, Thank you for watching you guys, I've been Johnny's, I'll see you next time, look at this environment I'm in, uh, I'll see you next time, bye.